okay thank you very much for tuning into my channel uh, in this blog I will explain how to connect UR5 uh, with the um, with ROS so if you do not if you're not familiar with UR5 so let me show you its pictures okay uh, so this one is UR5 a uh, very famous robot and it has different kinds of interface with the uh, MATLAB and things like that today I'm going to describe how to connect it with the uh, ROS okay so uh, if you go to their uh, blogs okay so they are uh, it has been mentioned in detail in this uh, particular blog in this github directory how to set up uh, and you uh, go through all the nece necessary steps of course you need to have Linux and ROS installed in it in my computer I am using Ubuntu 18.04 and Linux uh, and ROS Melodic so uh, going through all these um, um, discussion uh, okay so you have to install basically um, um, the, these all these things okay so you need to source your whatever your ROS is you need to make your directory and then clone the universal robot drivers and then this FMAUCH uh, calibration stuff and then you build it and this is very important command you also need you also need to make sure that it works uh, after that uh, do not follow this one this is uh, building from the source now after that you have to prepare your robot so prepare your robot you have to go for uh, this is very important you have to uh, deal with the real robot and you have to install external control UR cap which can be found uh, inside the resources so how to install external um, you can go over here in this particular link okay I'm using UR5 not E version so I followed this simple so you go through this you uh, open your uh, touch panel okay and then in touch panel you should be able to use this one so how to generate you go to installation external control set up the, set up the IP address so now I am going to describe how to uh, set up UR for ROS so let's just uh, power this so this is uh, this will take some time okay so let's go to the initialization so power on start okay um, here you need to make sure you go to the setup robot go to the network and make sure that you have this IP address 192.168.0.100 and then 255.255.255.0 also along with this you need to make sure that you have um, uh, M you, ha you have uh, wait a minute in installation you have this prof INET device disabled so if it is enabled you cannot um, set up UR for ROS so this is important um, next is external control so I will explain it to you so you need to make an empty program okay here you go over there and then uh, in installation you okay okay you go to the uh, installation and then structures and variables where is that okay the structure variable. okay in sorry so in structure you this you see this ur caps you put the external control so here and then you go to installation and then you set up this setup so i shall also share the link to do this thing so i have already done this so i'm not going to save it i'm gonna go previous 
previous i'm gonna exit so i'm gonna discard changes and i'm gonna um, run program and here this is load program so i have already made it open so i'm not gonna run it now stop i cannot run it now because first i have to run some commands in my pc so let's go to the system so uh, here first of all let me show you that uh, this is my wired settings in my computer i have uh, this IP uh, four so one nine two dot one six eight dot zero dot double seven and then two double five dot two double five dot two double five dot zero. Uh, once this is set, we are good to go. So we open uh, ROS. This is my working directory, and then you need to find the configuration. You run this command. And then it will download the configuration. So I have already downloaded it, but it will refresh it. So once it is downloaded, kill it. Then you need to run this command to upload this. To run this. Now you can see that uh, we have a message here. Okay. So now we need to go to the touch panel and then we need to run uh, external control. So here we are in the touch panel and uh, here I am going to run this. Now it is running, external control is running. Now you can see that robot ready to receive control command from the screen. So once this is up, you need to uh, now you need to run this second command so it's up and running and then you need to run this third command and before you run this third command I will uh, particularly mention that there is a file name in the in the f m a u c h un underscore universal underscore robot u r five move it uh, underscore config and then config and then controller dot y a m l you need to make sure you have this kind of file so once it is here it's good so we have executed this command this command and now we are going to execute this command okay. okay so it's good uh to for the safety uh, velocity should be scale uh, scaled down and acceleration should be also scaled down i will recommend you to scale it down so uh, maybe it's like point uh, 0.2 maybe and this one should be point 0.1 scale down and then let's move something a little bit now i will first show you here and then i will also show you in the screen in the actual real robot as well So let's first plan it to see if it is safe and then we plan and execute. And that's good. Thank you.